Hello and welcome back to Advanced Tactics Gold. It's now, what is it, 1946, October 1st actually, and um, we're pushing back, well pushing down from Moscow here. That's looking pretty good. We have the two uh, armies here, the red and the green. <clears throat> and down south here in the southwest side, we have the blue army expanding in, maybe taking Lyon. What I would like to do is come across down here, push down here, and they go across to here, basically. And that means it would take Vladivostok and St. Petersburg, four more Russian cities, and then take everything north of there before the Chinese uh, go too far. If you look at the map here, the minimap, they are fairly large here. So we'll see what we can do to make that happen. Um, meanwhile, yeah, um, what do we have about... Let's double check our supply. I keep doing that because I am concerned... Not really concerned. I know all of our production in New York City is actually geared towards uh, getting a supply out there. So I, I know we have a lot. 2218. Yep, that's plenty. You can see here, 100% supply. So that's the problem when you have a lot of units. It's very, very expensive to have supply going. It would be nice to have uh, more places we can get supply, but we only have three cities. And that would be Anchorage. No, four. Anchorage, Boston, Chicago, and New York City. Once you have those maxed out, you can't really get more supply, I don't think. We can get more units, um, but no supply. And while we're producing supply, we're not, we're not going to produce any soldiers either, right? So let's take a look and see what we have, um, what else we're producing. Not very much. Rifle, staff, and cavalry. Yeah, I did bring down the tank factories to nothing, because I need to get that supply out there. Uh, or the raw. I want to bring down the raw a little bit. Um, that's speaking of which, we do have one engineer here north of New York City. Is he ready? Yeah, he can go up there. Um, how is the supply looking here? Yep. Uh, maybe build a road. Continue the road a little bit further north, though. There, and maybe one more. Yeah, I think so. Up there. Now our supply should look pretty good there. Yeah, I might be able to. That's a 50% reduction. We might be able to get up there now with our engineer and get more of that raw. Not a big rush because I'm not actually using any any raw at all at the moment. And I think that's actually okay. Because if you look here, the stuff that costs raw would be tanks. We have one medium tank in storage. Eight standard or eight light tanks. And... Um, what about artillery? 11 artillery. Yeah, if we lose artillery, we can really reinforce well. We have a lot of units, except riflemen and rangers. We don't have too many of them. What are we producing elsewhere? Anchorage supply as well. Wow, and five riflemen. Well, that's always good. Four cav. Do we need that many cav? I don't think we do. In Chicago, we'll go down to zero, and instead of that... Oh, we are one away from a truck. Let's get one truck there. And what about Boston? Political points, machine gun, and cargo ship. What if I do one more cargo ship? Yeah, let's do that. Let's bring down this. So next turn I'll come back and look at that in a little more detail. Because I want to be able to produce uh, maybe more rangers and riflemen. So now we're using 24. That's fine. There we go. Okay, so now, what do we do here? I think it's... We haven't moved any of our units. Yeah, we have moved them up here. We have. And we did... We did fire. Okay, well, in that case, let's go ahead and see what the French will do. They are next up here after us in the turn order. Now they're firing again. Oh. Well, let's hold out there and see. Maybe we can... I need to get, find where they are. You know what? Well, now I can't bring down my planes. I was going to say I can bring down my fighters, do a reconnaissance, but I can't really do that because I don't have an airfield or a city or an air factory. I think an air factory is good too. Uh, from any of those or a carrier, you can um, do a reconnaissance. It would have been good to have a carrier out there, wouldn't it? But that costs political points. So. And that's Germany. Um, all right. And that's us now. We um, infantry losses 34. That's not good. Uh, all right, let's take a look. Uh, well, let's actually look at the history here. 
They attacked here. Heavy artillery, they had one, they lost none, and they killed one bazooka, four rangers, and one mortar. Right over there. And then they attacked again over there, and what did we do? We had... Oh, we had the cav unit there. Look at that. He actually took them out. Lost 28. We must have backed up here. I'm sure we did. So, this is going to be a tough spot to hold, right? Our artillery may have to do good here. I'm not sure I can hold it. Maybe I can, maybe I can't. Hmm. Hmm. So here you can see we have now 12 cav left, and they're not in great shape. Readiness 54. We do have two artillery pieces, though. Do we see... What is this here? Infantry gun. We don't know what this is. AT gun, submachine gun. Well, yeah, 149 recon, pretty high. Five armored car and a light tank, and two armored cars over here. Where is his artillery? You know what? I bet it can reach three. That's why we can't see it. Can we make a move and uh, attack into Lyon? It's possible. Open terrain here. If we take this one and then go into Lyon, maybe. Ooh, uh, what do we have? We can attack from one direction, but we can really do some damage. 100% readiness. But I think I can take it out. This shouldn't be a problem. What if we take this one? Then move everybody down this way. Problem with that is that he is... Then we lose our entrenchment. And I can't really reach his heavy artillery at all. I can take out his other units, but not that. So, we are at 119 political points. What can I build? Well, the dive bomber specializing in attacking enemy units. But how do I get a dive bomber here? I would have to build an airfield in this area right around here. And then um, from there, or I can do take Lyon and put it there, but taking Lyon seems tough. What does he have here? Three units. Who do I want to take out? These two attacked, yeah. We need to take out this one here, I think. We'll attack this one first with our artillery. We'll attack with both. So we'll do all, and that should do quite a bit of damage. One. You can see the green bar there. Ah, we didn't they didn't quite take them out. There's five more left. But now we should be able to take them out. 19 redness, no entrenchment. Let's attack them there. We'll attack them with the um, 8th Ranger Brigade there. So we'll attack, we'll do a normal land attack, and we'll take this one. Will that be enough? I think it will be enough, actually. Then we go up and attack the next one there. Maybe we will. We can go up here, too, and attack from two directions. Maybe we'll do that. Let's go ahead and attack with this one first. Oh, bad move. We had to retreat. We lost a lot of our rangers there. He lost one unit. Okay, so I could... Can I attack again? I can. Who do I have here? Cav, open terrain is good. And I can also attack with my garrison unit here. We'll give that a shot. Do I? No, let's not do it. This was a bad move, because uh, we can't really get reinforcements here very quickly, can we? 15 rangers. We don't have that many. They're going to come traveling all the way from over here. And how many do we have? I don't see any rangers. No. Do we have any up here? Mm, we do have four. I think I need to switch over and get some more rangers. I think I can then ship them over here. Just sit tight here, maybe. Problem is, he's going to come in with his um, heavy artillery. I think we need to go and get a dive bomber in here. We do have an engineer here. They could build... I can't build anything right here. And a factory has to have a space of one in between it to the next factory. But if we go down here, there, and build over here, an airbase maybe. Should we do an airbase here? We're okay, we can do it right now. Once we do that, we can then send our um, fighters over here, and we can also build some uh, 
dive bombers. I think I might do that. Let's build an airbase here. Outside Lyon. And then we'll take... Uh, this is a little bit risky, right? Because if we lose that airbase, he has already moved. No, 100. We commission... Uh, wait a minute, it's mud season. Can't do anything November. Oh, shoot. Well, we're hoping the snow comes quick and then he can move over there. So let's go ahead and take and get that... Is it a dive bomber I want? Or do I want... Level bomber. Let's see. Bombing bridges, towns, and troops. Or dive bomber. Hmm. Dive bomber. I think maybe a dive bomber. It costs the same. Troops. Troops infantry. Dive bombers is for... Uh, more for armor, I think. Artillery is not considered armor, but we'll go for dive bomber, I guess. Okay. There we have it. Now, which where should I build some dive bombers? Maybe in Anchorage? This is not good. I'm not feeling good about this. No, not in Anchorage. We're building supply there. What about in Boston? Cargo ship, done. Let's bring that down. Uh, 80 gun, nothing. Political points go to zero. And instead here, we'll do aircraft dive bomber. Going to get one dive bomber out of that. That is going to be slow going, isn't it? Um, hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to put my unit in Moscow formation. And we'll say it's going to belong to this HQ. Yep, and then we're going to make it, well, we're going to make it a dive bomber unit. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and select this here. And we're going to say it's going to be dive bomber. You know what? I'm not sure that we're going to survive there in the West with a third army. That is going to be tough. So type of formation, we're going to say dive bomber. And how many can we fit on there? One dive bomber is stacking points zero. Oh, they're flying. Okay. I uh, don't think it shows up there. We're going to say, what, five? Power points 100. That seems pretty good. Let's do that. And then for here, what do we say here? Well, let's leave it at that for now and go out here. And then I switch him. I tran When I transfer unit over there, we'll see what symbol they come up with, and I'll use that symbol as well. So that's the die bomber unit, though, next turn. Meanwhile, we're going to have to sit tight here. We lost 10 rangers there and a bazooka. On the other hand, they are pretty weak here with the light tank and armor car, but they have two more up there. We have to use more of artillery, I guess, but they're going to keep pounding us there. All right, uh, let's take a look and see what happened here, though, as far as supplies or uh, require, request uh, reinforcements coming in. So we had what coming in here? Request for riflemen, horses, mortar, bazooka, ranger, and cavalry. And we do have rangers here. He cannot ship it in, I guess, using the ship. Um, if I go to... Land cap 4,000. He doesn't have a... That's right. He doesn't have a naval unit associated with him. But let's go ahead and send... We'll transfer them over to the... The headquarter unit. Now, he should be able to send it out next time. So let's leave it at that for there. And uh, we can always continue here. And maybe if we can be fast enough to come down here and help them out. If they can hold out there. Maybe... Now, we do have our spearhead here. These, This is a very strong unit. 93 stack, about 225. Now, we had two artillery pieces here. If I move one up there, and one... Move both of them up there. And then we'll attack this unit here. Barrage, we'll take this one. I think about this one. This one, look at how many units they have. Let's do that. And they have an artillery piece right there. Okay, let's go for that. There we go. We're taking out a lot of their tanks. So they have now morale gone down. Entrenchment is almost nothing. Redness was still well, was nothing before. Experience went up a lot on them. 59 now. Okay, so that's that unit there. Can I attack it now? <laughs> no entrenchment. 10 armored cars. Hmm. Although my, I think my medium tank here, like we said, it is especially good against lighter tanks. 
Let's compare that against a light tank. Uh, there it is. So on the left hand side we are here. So against armor 1800. Their value against us is 1200 or 800 to defend. So B might be able to do it. He has these units here. If you add them all up it's not going to come to more than what 40. And we have 225. We should I think we could probably attack him there and move in. Let's give that a shot just with the one medium unit there. Do we have anybody else? We do have one more here. You know what? I think I might take this one too. What do we end up with then? 93 out of 100. Yeah, let's do that. Wow, look at the casualties. That's all it took. Three rounds and they are gone. Yeah, very, very strong. Their unit, uh, our unit here, the medium tank. If I move him in here, I can still attack. Uh, I can also attack right away now if I want to. Let's take a look here. What do we have? Nothing really there. We'll take our Ranger Brigade and move him into the factory. And then he has 50 left. Can he attack here? He can attack one more time. Who is good to take out? This one here, 101 against... Are they all zero? Yeah, we'll take them out here. So we'll take him... Although I could take the tank. No, the tank can go down here, maybe, and attack this way. Yeah, let's do that. Let's take this one. We'll say attack, land attack, and we're going to take our Ranger Brigade. There. Good. I could advance now. Do I want to advance? Yeah. Hmm. Maybe I do. Block him a little bit there, and we'll advance in here. And then we'll attack. We have 70 left. If I attack here, the HQ, that might be the best option. There are two light tanks here, though. Yeah, I think I'll attack that, them instead. So we have five light tanks here against his three armored cars and two light tanks, but 13 redness, and we have 100. Let's go for that. Yeah, there's no contest there. We have 150, he had 83 in power points there. So now I can move in there, right, for free. We only have 10 left, that's fine. We're in the forest, not ideal, but we'll take maybe this unit and move him. Wait a minute, can I attack here? 17 readiness, uh, 6 armored cars, who should attack? Yeah, we, uh, we'll attack here too. We'll take that ranger and we'll take... Um, yeah, we'll take the garrison unit too. But we took him out. Now let's move up with those two, I think, into this. Well, that hex he vacated. Okay, so we could attack here, it's saying. Um, yeah, that might be an option. Let's see here. Who can attack? This one cannot attack. This one could attack. Let's do that. He retreated. That's all he did. Okay, well, that's fine. Can I go out down here and... Uh, move in yes I can I like that that looks good to me well now we'll take the submachine gun and in here and help the medium tank they're gonna be cut off here so that's gonna be fine there's an opening here though don't really like that what about this one here that's our dive bomber there that's right army here okay uh, artillery here's a garrison unit uh, and a submachine gun what do we have here then it's not much to them there. We could probably take them out. Let's do that. Let's attack here. Uh, two units. We'll take our garrison. Why can't I take him? Um, hmm. With the mud, I can't do it. It costs too much, even though we have 100. None of those can attack. Or those. Oh, he's in the forest there. Land attack. No, I did I click the wrong thing? I probably did. Let's go with the garrison and um, light tank. We'll take them as well. That's right. We get two light tanks here. Yeah, let's take these and then we'll see about this one here. 
Yeah, we took him out. Good. So he moved back there. Now, what about this one here? There are three units. One is has a few... Well, we're at an S10. Not much. 13 armored cars. If we attack with this one, let's take our tanks first and move in here. And also the uh, garrison unit. Can they attack anymore? 40? They cannot. I think you need at least 50, right? Yeah, I need 50. So now these units can attack, but I could attack with, wait a minute, this cav unit, that's open terrain, so that would be good for him. Mud is not great though, I think. We'll go over here. Should we go over there and attack from this direction? Yeah, we'll do that probably, right? And then we'll attack here, and we'll take that cav. Oh, 20 left. All right, so you're just gonna hold steady then, okay. What do we have then that can attack this one and this one? These two units attacking that one. That's a lot of armored cars and light tanks. Hmm. Hmm. I think I'll wait with them. We'll attack next turn instead. I don't think I have anybody. Oh, wait a minute. I do have a few units left up here. Move him down there. Now we can attack. Now I feel better about it. Let's do that. There, from two directions. Um... The garrison, I'm going to leave him for now. These two is going to attack. We'll see if that will be enough. Did a lot of damage, actually. But we did eliminate every single unit of his there. That's that's good. And then we have one more garrison to move. Uh, just bring up the rear. Um, where do we go? Down here, I think. Into the tank factory, yep. All right, so we have cleaned up here. We're pushing him back. Not very fast, though, thinking about these third army units there. Up here, um, okay, we're going to go ahead and attack there for sure. That's open terrain, yeah. And uh, I guess we'll take this one, too. All right, now we can advance in. We're going to advance in with this one. And what does he have? Two and six armored units there. It is what? Open terrain as well? Well, let's take this cav unit as well. And we'll just go ahead and can we attack nine? No, ten readiness. No entrenchment. Yeah. We'll, we'll attack there then and we'll see if that is enough. It is. Just doing five bazookas. <laughs> okay, good. Now we can take the other ones and move them up here. There, so now we have a couple units there. We'll take this um, garrison unit as well. He can't move off the track here. We don't have any... Uh, we don't have any engineer to help him out to build a road there either. So we're going to push them back slowly. There's two units here. If I move him over, that's swamp. That is not a good spot, but... What does he have here? Mm, okay. We should be able to hold that, I think. Even though Swamp, I don't think Swamp is good for, um... Swamp up, oh, nothing. Okay, no modifier. Okay. Mm. I, th I thought it was a negative modifier there, but it's not. So if I move my artillery, I'll move them up here. Should I come around here or down here? Now I'll go down here. There, we'll take those two. I still have 50 left. What if we fire here? Ludwig Becker is over there, or we'll take these. I think we'll take these. There's a flak unit there, too. Let's do a artillery barrage. We'll take both of them. 180 there, or flak there. They had to retreat. Details, not details. Uh, switch view. Yeah, they're not doing great, right? So they retreated. Uh, okay, so we're sitting there. That's fine. There's one more garrison unit. Move down there. Putting up behind them. This is looking great. I have no problem here. This I'm worried about. If they can hold out there. If they get supply, I'm not sure. We took some damage here too, so I don't know if they're going to be reinforced before the ones down there. Now what about our production? We're getting um, Rifleman 6, Staff, and a Dive Bomber. What about Boston? One dive bomber, okay. Chicago, political points and staff. And then we have, you know what? 
I think I might switch here. And we'll switch over to Ranger. No, wait. Not there. Here. And that will give us five Rangers. That's good. That's going to help fill in the gaps there, I think. Bring that up. Um, 15 Rangers, maybe. I think we're going to need it. We're going to get go for that. Okay, let's go for that and see what the French do. Keep my fingers crossed. That third army is... Hmm. That's France attacking. We're still in the same spot, it looks like. He didn't push us out. Hmm. Arab League, okay. And it's Germany. Uh, let's see what they do. Okay, we lost, we took supply, we lost uh, two infantry, that's all. Okay, they must have used that uh, darn artillery again. 38 steps, wow. Okay, an attack here, we lost one artillery piece, wow. And we lost two rangers, okay, good. We had 18. 18? I think we got reinforcement there. Okay, just looking to see what he's doing. He's moving units in. We have a front now we can hold, I think. There's not that... It's not very wide front there, right? Okay, good. So up here we can... We're going to fold in the, th the second army and move him up east. Then we'll spearhead here. We'll take... Where is he at? There, our medium tanks. Move them down quickly here to the French, I think. But down here, what happened? Um, well, let's see what we got. We have 54 here, 82 readiness, 72. We have 17 rangers. What happened? Let's see if we got reinforcements. We wanted three, got none. Okay, we had one at 10 rangers, we got two. Okay, we did get some. That's good. 54, that was not much. How about here, the cav? We wanted 28, we got one. <laughs> well, it's better than nothing, right? So now we have an air base here. We should have one dive bomber, dive bomber here somewhere. Here? Oh, no, wait. We're going to set it to here, right? This one. So if I uh, say I want to transfer a dive bomber from over here, we should have one waiting. Right? We made produced one. Yep, there it is. We're going to take him and transfer over to here. There, die bomber. And now we get uh, that symbol. Okay, same one. Is it the same one? No, it's not quite the same. At the very tail end here, it's like a plus sign. Okay, well, let's see if I, I can find that in the model here. So it's a die bomber. I'm going to go to NATO. And I think, is it this one here? Or is it the other one? Let's see. No, it's the other one. It's this one here. It's this one here. So we'll take that, and we don't put a size on it. We call it die bomber. That's fine. And uh, call that good. We're going to have five of them eventually. So now there is one. I could move him over now. If I move him, no, I can't. Zero. Okay. And we just made that unit. Okay. So let's not worry about that. We are taking damage, but how are we doing? He has 120 engineering points. What can we do? We can't do anything in that hex. Artillery piece are looking good. We don't see his artillery at all, though. What about my 25, 5, 3, and 10? 125 entrenchment. Are we sitting in um, fields? This is where I want to go. I want to be right here, actually, if I could. One armored car, one submachine gun. Only 98 in recon, though. Two armored cars. You know what? I'll take the... No, fighter can't go. It's uh, the reason I couldn't move my dive bomber. It's not because I just created it. It's because it's mud season, December. Once winter comes around, I think we can do it. So we have two artillery pieces here. We could push this one out, right? Couldn't we? And then move into the suburb. That's better. But if I do that, then I have to move everybody back down. And then the problem is um, he might attack me, having poor... Having very poor um, entrenchment. One AT gun here. Two armored cars. Mm, we could attack this one as well. 
or oh, this one here has better yeah we attack this one let's do that we'll take there we'll take this one and do a barrage on him let's see if I can see the life going down there yeah, we took two. Oh, yep two good perfect so two of them are gone one armored car left we could probably kill him now 190 in recon and we have a few units they're not mm, super strong but he is not strong either so let's go ahead and do that we'll take attack with all this one as well yeah we should probably do all of them just to make sure we eliminate that unit Yep, and that, that was good. He retreated. We didn't actually eliminate all of them, but hmm. he retreated. We can now move in here, and I think I might want to do that. What? How is the supply situation there? Yep, it's green, so that's better. Is it better to go in there? Well, it's better because the 10th Brigade well, won't be as exposed here. However, we don't really get anything for it, right? Get a little bit more of an eyeball here. They already have, well, they have 14 entrenchment, 25, 25. Yeah, nothing much, actually. Let's move in there. That's a free action. Wait a minute, look at that. 100% readiness, 8 armored cars. I wish I had some artillery now to fire on that guy. So now we have entrenchment 50, 50, and 39. Yeah, that's going to be very interesting to see if we can hold out here. Well, we are not that far away. Well, let's leave them to their destiny over there. Over here, I feel much better. Because we do have... Where are they at? They're right here. We have two light tanks there. We have taken this tank factory. Well, we're going to say that the HQ is going to be New York City. But I'm not going to produce anything, I don't think, right now there okay we're taking it away from Germany at least um, all right um, we could probably exploit this and take this here they're pretty weak right why don't we go ahead and attack here there's open terrain so we'll take our cab there and uh, hmm they're already attacking do I want the submachine guns to attack there? Could the cab defeat them? Maybe. But I should have some anti-tank uh, weapons there. Maybe we'll move up one of my light tanks. First, we'll take the first regiment there. Move him up here. And then we'll go ahead and uh, attack there. And we'll take these two. Yeah, that, that did it. That's good. And then we can now take uh, the light tank and move in here. I think I'm going to do that, actually. And uh, what do we have here? Nothing much, right? Pretty high recon value. So we're in good shape there, it looks like. So we could just attack this hex here. One. Is that enough? Yeah, we'll give it a shot. Yeah, that's plenty. Okay, pushing them back. We're moving him forward as well. I can attack again. I think I might do that attack down here on Hans Richter. He is the headquarter for these units here. So let's do that. We'll uh, do a land attack there and see if we can eliminate him. Yeah, now he's not gone. Okay, so now we own this one. I'm going to move him up there. There's another HQ, Robert von Richenau. We are getting close there. I want to save my, uh, where is it, here for the, a bigger attack, right? Or put punch through. If I move him up, well, wait, we had one more light tank. If I move this one up here, then I attack here. There's one light tank, four armored cars. I think I can take them out with just a light tank. We'll try it. Yep, I did. Then we'll take him and move him down here. And then we'll take my medium tank, move him up here. 20 left. Okay, never mind. We can't attack. Hmm, unfortunate. Um, I'm going to push them out here, I think. We have two artillery pieces as well. Um, hmm. What do we have here? 
Yep, this won't be good to attack, wouldn't it? Move them up. If I move them up here... Uh, can I move him? I cannot move him there. He doesn't have enough horses. He's slow, this one. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and attack there. We'll do a barrage with that artillery piece. Mm, only one staff there eliminated. But now I should be able to attack him, I think, here pretty easily. There's some uh, armored vehicles here. Light tank, actually, and flak. What if I attack here first? Let's do that, and we'll take these two. They belong to different uh, HQs, but that's fine. Can I attack one more time? He has 50 left. This one has 50 left as well. So if we do an attack here with those two, let's see if that will work. Those two. Um... Well, wait a minute. What if I... Do I have one more here? I have an artillery piece here. Okay. Let's do it and do a barrage here first and, and warm him up. That should make a difference. Nobody died. Nope. Nobody died. But we can go ahead and take him out now, I think. Yeah, I took some uh, casualties, but we did take him out. He moved back down there. There's uh, one light tank and one armored car left. Uh, we'll defend there, I think. There's one more artillery piece, actually, I have here. What if I move him down here? Um, yep, down here. He has 40 left. Can I still attack? Cannot. Need 50. Okay. Then we'll uh, move this one over here to help support him. Um, this one over, uh, now I can't move him, hmm. It's this one here, where can he go? He can go back, he can't go in there. All right, move him down there. I really wanted to go up this way, right? But, um, I can attack with this one only now. I don't want to do that. Uh, that's not worth it. Okay, let's move up our other units in the rear. I need to actually move one down here, don't I? To protect that area. Right now he's going to be cut off. Otherwise, can he move one more? He cannot. I uh, should have thought about that. What about this one here? 30? Nope, can't do it. I think this cav unit can there. 45? He can move down there, but it's only a 5 cav. All right, we'll do it. It's a recon unit, but uh, what the heck, we'll do that. Um, 10 readiness, one light tank. Okay, do we have an artillery piece here? None up here, yep, okay. So if I move this one down here, then we'll attack this one. What about this one here? Yeah, we'll attack this one here with that machine gun. He retreated, so we can move this one forward. And then we'll attack this one here. I think we can take him out as is. Let's try that. Yeah, more or less. Now this one can advance into that space. And we have one more behind him. And there's our cav. Uh, move the cav over here. Yeah, it's open terrain. That's going to be good for him if he attacks into open terrain later on. Okay, can't move him anymore. Um, that artillery, I mean, that headquarter can't move. So we've done everything we can up here in the north. Um, yeah, we are producing the supporting uh, troops here. I mean, reinforcements, but is that going to be enough? We'll see. Uh, well, I'm way over my time. I will be back later on with more from Advanced Tactics, I guess. Hey guys, this is Time and Tactics. Thank you very much for watching the video. It sure helps me out a lot. If you'd like, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and or that like, and I will see you in the next video.